big deal, and we got on with our life. It was embarrassing, but because our relationship was strong and all our friends knew it, and they knew what they were reading wasn't uh, necessarily the truth, um, hey, we just tried to put it behind us and ignore it as much as we could. An ATV Evening News Preview. Good afternoon, Steve Murphy live at the ATV News Center with more breaking news here at this hour. The Via Atlantic is off the rails. Via is dropping its passenger rail service between Halifax, St. John and Montreal, effective the middle of December. St. John without passenger rail service. Details coming up tonight at 6 o'clock. Also on your evening news, he may be guilty, but Josh Randall Borden is not going to jail for this particular crime. The country's highest court says Borden really did sexually assault a 69-year-old woman, but find out why the conviction doesn't stand tonight at 6. And also on your evening news, it's the Battle of the Great Pumpkins. Yes, who is the true record holder for the world's largest pumpkin? Well, different judges have different views of who the real world heavyweight pumpkin champion is. We'll get to the bottom of all this pumpkin politics tonight at the ATV Evening News at 6, right after Live at 5 with Paul and Nancy. You guys. Thank you, Steve. And coming up, uh, the very latest on the developments on the NHL season. Will they play or won't they play? Uh, things are changing uh, at this very moment. We'll have the latest for you at 5. Also ahead tonight, more fun with Fonts in Florida. Fonts Jessam joins us live from Disney World to inject a little sunshine into your day. And Mike Duffy will have some uh, informative and entertaining news from Parliament Hill as he joins us for our weekly chat from Ottawa. Also ahead, the plays of the week. Yvonne Colbert on your side and Steve Weagle's up-to-the-minute prognostications from the ATV Weather Center. Steve, what's up? Thanks, guys. A low-pressure system will continue to dominate the weather picture in the Maritimes, and that means unsettled weather for the next few days. You want to bring in a jacket or, or an umbrella with you during the weekend. It looks like it'll be cool, and we're also looking at brief showers scattered throughout the region on the weekend. Temperatures are also expected to drop overnight tonight down to the low single digits in some areas. I'll give you all the details right through the weekend coming up on Live at 5. Hope to see you then.